Welcome to the homework for Lesson 3. This is Module 6 of First Grade. Don't forget to put your name on here first. You won't remember it when you're done later. Write the tens and the ones. Complete the statement. So the statements are these things down here. And we're just write the tens and ones. We're going to put those in the place value charts right there. And these, whenever you see a group of something like this, or like, like these bushels of strawberries, and those look like cartons of pencils, and then later on you're going to see pictures of Diana's blocks, like rods and, and single ones. Just any group, you see a group like that, just assume that it's 10. We could zoom in really close and count, and there really are 10. Um, but it, the idea is that we're going to count 10s as 10s, and we're going to count 1s by 1s. So how many tens do we have? One, two, three, four, five tens. Two ones, right there. Fifty-two is five tens and two ones. And uh, number two, we're going to count tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine tens. And we have two rows of four here. That's four plus four. That's eight ones. So what number is this? It's 98, which has nine tens and eight ones. Count the, count the tens, right? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine tens. And how many ones are there? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We just counted 97. There are 97 cubes. And here we're going to count the tens. One, two, three, four, five tens. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine ones. That's 59 cubes. And here we're counting ten. There are no ones. We're just counting tens. One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are ten tens and zero ones. That's a hundred. If you want to count them by tens, it's ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, a hundred. One hundred cubes. And how many tens do we have here? Remember, we're counting tens, so we don't want to think about the, um, Think about the number there is in tens. So, and what I mean by that is this, we're not going to count 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and write 80 tens. Because there's not 80 tens. There's only 8 tens. We don't want to have, because otherwise this would end up being 806. And it's, and it's not. Uh, there are how many tens? There are 8 tens. 8 groups of 10. And there are 6 ones. So there's 86 cubes. And now here, if we're counting tens, there's one, two, three, four, five, six groups of ten. And how many ones are there? In carrots, we're looking at a five-group row, six, seven. That's 67 carrots. And here we're looking at boxes of markers. How many groups of ten are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those. And how many ones? There's one, two, three, four, five of five single markers, 75 markers. Write the number as tens and ones in the place value chart, or use the place value chart to write the number. So we're, they're going to give you one or the other. 70 is seven tens and zero ones. And 76 is 7 tens and 6 ones. And then here we have 49, right? Because that's 4 tens, 9 ones, that's number 49. 9 tens and 4 ones is 94. And 
one of the things you should really should be doing, it doesn't say this here, but one of the things you should be doing, like I am, is when you look at this number here, you should be trying to say name that number. Because really, you don't get a lot of chance to practice that in first grade, it's actually naming the numbers. But if you can, actually say the number names out loud. It's a lot different than thinking them, because sometimes you find out that it, you, when you try to say out loud something that you think you know, maybe it's harder to say because you don't really know it. So just try it and see if you know. And if you don't know, ask somebody. Ask, what, what is that number? How do you say that? And they'll tell you. Six tens, and you can look at this and say, oh, well, that's, I see 65. That's six tens and five ones because you're looking, you know how just to write the number into a place value box. 60. That's six tens and zero ones. And say it out loud, just like I do when you do your homework. That's 90, which is nine tens and zero ones. This is 10 tens and zero ones. That's the number 100, because 10 tens makes 100. 83, all right, that's 8 tens, that's 80, and 3 ones, that's the number 83. And here we have 8 tens, zero ones, that's just the number 80. And that's it.